So today we are discussing this X-ray. Let's talk about the history first. A 60-year-old male got admitted with shortness of breath. Previously, he was investigated for dysphagia. While physical examination is being done, there are a few bibasal crackles on auscultation. Now, our area of interest is this region. Let's talk about the findings. In this x-ray, the esophagus is distended. There is a gas fluid level at the level of the carina. Now the question is, what may be the cause of this gaseous distension of the esophagus? In the history, we found that the patient was previously investigated for dysphagia. So the abnormality is most likely secondary to esophageal dysmotility and achalasia. Another question would be, what other imaging study can be considered? And the answer should be contrast swallow. This contrast study is showing distended atonic esophagus with relaxed lower esophageal sphincter. This confirms the diagnosis of achalasia. Achalasia is a failure of organized esophageal peristalsis causing impaired relaxation of the lower esophageal sphincter and resulting in food stasis and often marked dilatation of the esophagus. Chest radiograph findings include convex opacity overlapping the right mediastinum, air fluid level due to stasis in a thoracic esophagus filled with retained secretions and food, small or absent gastric bubble, anterior displacement and bowing of the trachea on the lateral view, patchy alveolar opacities, usually bilateral, may be seen. These represent acute pneumonitis or chronic aspiration pneumonia related to dysphagia. Thanks for watching. For more videos like this, please subscribe to our channel. The following videos may be useful to you.